Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to another installment in our Retro Throwbacks series. Today, we are having a look at, well, a game that's apparently set in the distant future year of 2151. This is tough enough, and I'm of the assumption that it's going to be similar to some of the other brawlers that we have done up until this point. There's a uh, one... Uh, player 1 versus player 2 versus CPU and a story mode. Let's go ahead and jump into a story mode section and see how this goes. We have Soya, Vexi, Katano, and Votes. Cool. Let's go ahead and pick uh, Vont, uh, Katano, I think. And we have Soyo uh, coming in here from Japan, H22, Bare Fist. Uh, looks like it's going to be another brawler type game and as always with these types of games there is no uh, real there is no real Wow, okay. Can I... How do you throw these? Wow. There's gotta be a way for you to use these projectile attacks. Because I am using just about every button on my controller and they just don't want to do that. I don't know what that was. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Get over these. What is up with these uh, characters and being able to do projectile type moves? That just doesn't make any sense to me. Because I can't do this on my own. Oh, and of course you can replay the final strike of the match. That's just rude. Come on. Just get out of this already. Ah, uh, that's annoying. No, we don't want to continue. Let's then switch over to the main character that we just fought against then. And we'll see if anything is kind of... Uh... So we have a power punch and a power kick. I just, I don't, so we have power punch on X, kick on Y, but it doesn't say anything about the uh, power up moves or in terms of doing a projectile. Like that's the problem that I have with some of these things. Uh, sure, let's go back to being on a story mode. Let's start. And let's pick uh, Sayo, and uh, knowing full well that we're not going to be able to use this projectile attack of his. Come on. Ooh, don't Hadoken me. Come on. Oh, get away from him. What is this movement you're doing? Back and forth, jumping over me? That's absurd. Yeah, just get me in a loop once you get down to a low enough level of health. That's just ridiculous. 
Oh, come on. Sure, there's a knee. If you're gonna block repeatedly, I'm gonna get to a point where I can... Oh, don't do that to me! Oh, the lingering hitbox on that, really? That's absurd. And there's just not a way for you to do that, huh? There's not a way for you to inherently figure out how you are going to get your own hits in. Like, you should at least have a general understanding or a general uh, concept of how to perform certain movements. That's a grab of some sort. Okay, come on. Okay, sure. Don't do that to me. Come on. Don't do that. Is there a way to... Like, is there a button combo? You have to hit two attacks at the same time. What is it? Because there's no clear indication as to how anyone is to perform some of these moves. Let's back up off the start. That's... Does only my opponents have some sort of a move? Don't give that to me! Come on. What's with these leg sweeps here? That's just stupid. There's no indication of how one is supposed to do any of these moves. You know what? We're going to do this. We're going to get a second player in here, and we are going to uh, bring in a CPU, and we're just going to figure out how in the world you're supposed to do... No, we're not going to do that. I don't generally rewind on these, but I'm not going to continue because I'm going to switch over to having a second player so I can figure out however these projectile attacks happen because you would think that that's something that they would explain to you, but it's not. This is infuriating as to how dumb this is. There's us there, and then let's go ahead and select Katino. Also, four characters isn't really something that's... Uh, interesting with that so let's go ahead and back out away from our opponent like there's just not a whole lot of Indicated. Okay, so there's that. So I did something there. But it's still not very clear. As to what it is or how you can do it. Also, this timer isn't particularly great. Yeah, sure, it's a draw game, but I didn't learn anything. There's literally no button combo here. Come on. There's gotta be something here. Like, why would it... Do I have to guard? Is there a way to guard? Like, the triggers don't do anything, except for that one suspends the game. Come on, is there... there's no button combo that you can do with buttons here? 
That's just... Come on. I did something there a moment ago where I was able to... Okay, what was that? I finally got the projectile to go in there. But how in the world do you do that reliably? That's not a perfect. Don't give me that. Sure, cool, whatever. Give me the points. I don't care. Now let's switch over to our player two, I guess. So we can prolong this to a longer bout if we need to. Because there's got to be a way for us to... Come on, give me a projectile to throw here. How did you do it before? How did I do it before? I can't even tell. Yeah, that's not really telling me anything. This is just, like, fighting games in this time frame just did not have any form of rhyme or balance to them whatsoever. Like, come on. There's no clear indicative method of how these games are meant to be. And how one is supposed to do certain attacking movements from them. Like... That, that causes me to jump. And I can't do that either. Like, do you, do you have to double tap or insert them at just the right frequency? Like, you're just matching at this point and nothing is really coming out. Like, you can see that I'm getting interesting variations on different moves based off what I'm doing. Like, there's a jab here, there's a uh, hook there, but there's none of these buttons that just kind of do things on their own. It's really weird. And you'd think that there would be some sort of tutorial as, hey, press this button and this button in order to throw a combo or a general walkthrough of how this is supposed to go. But if I back up and I hit all these buttons, then nothing happens. If I hold this button here, I just jump in place. But there's nothing that is inherently repetitive enough for me to get a... Like... Like, do I have to hold on to multiple buttons at the same time? How does one throw that? Like, I got it to happen just there, but I couldn't replicate it. And I have no idea what that would have been. Yeah, sure, that's another perfect or whatever you want to call it. I don't think it's perfect. I don't... I think that this is a highly flawed game, and I think that's consistent across a lot of the fighting games that we were seeing on this platform. Uh, just because there's no real rhyme or reason as to how uh, you do what you're meant to do. No, we're not going to challenge again. And we're going to try one final time to fight a computer, a story, now that we've tried a little bit to hash out some of these broken controls. Uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go with so uh, Soya. I don't even know how this name is pronounced, and I'm not going to try and figure it out. But let's go ahead and see if we can projectile camp out our opponent or something with the two projectiles that we actually... Come on. Don't get me in this loop. Okay, what is it with these moves that you're pulling out out of nowhere all of a sudden? Let me throw my own, damn it! Are 
No, don't do that. That's so dumb. That's so stupid. Like, there's no indication of how you're meant to do anything in this game. Oh, and yeah, you can just combo me right into multiple of those strikes. Do I just get to poke you in the corner here until... Oh, don't give me that. Don't give me that. Come on. Oh, that's just so stupid. I hate this game. There's no reason for it to do anything that it does. I will never play it again. And I don't care if I ever learn how its mechanics intentionally work. This is stupid. Zero out of five. Completely asinine and just... Ugh. Not intuitive in any way, shape, or form. Don't play this game at all. It's very, very bad. I've liked some of the things that this developer has done, but their fighting games? Absolutely garbage. But if you enjoyed watching this video, leave a like on it, I guess. Have a good day.